What's going on everybody? I hope you're all having a wonderful day today. For those of you that are new to the channel, my name is Ty and today in this video, I'm going to be reacting to the brand new The Acolyte Star Wars trailer that released about two or three hours ago. I'm a little bit late here, but I'm a college kid and I got college classes. I just want to watch this trailer. It's going to be playing for you guys right here. Guys, if you guys like movie related content, I'm your guy. Please consider dropping a like on this video if you enjoy it and also subscribe if you want to stick around. I want to hit a thousand subscribers so bad. But listen, I don't want to waste any more time. Looking at this trailer though, um, the like to dislike ratio, 76,000 likes to 48,000 dislikes on the official Star Wars channel. That's pretty insane, but uh, yeah, let's just take a look at this. I'm going to play it in three, two, one, go. Close your eyes. Some kids here, okay. Don't tell Anakin. Your eyes can deceive you. Okay. We must not trust them. I think this place takes place before the Phantom Menace, right? Tell me what comes into your mind. Is that Coruscant? I might be wrong. All right. Oh, I, see, I love like these little like huts and stuff. I see fire. Where they're like sketchy. Sorry, I don't want to talk over this. Hmm. Oh, I love a good hand to ha hand combat fight. Oh, no. all right, that actually looks pretty decent. The effects in these shows have always been bad, I feel like. Someone is killing Jedi. Interesting premise. It doesn't make sense. Okay. Oh, the guy from Squid Game. I sense the darkness. All right. It actually looks pretty good, like the, the combat. It doesn't look cheap. A darkness rises. Damn. Okay. This is about power. I really like the color grading so far. What is that? Oh. Damn. Damn, this looks expensive actually. The Acolyte. Two episode premiere June 4th. Nice. June's gonna be stacked for TV shows and Disney Plus. Wow, June is going to be a stacked month for TV shows. You got The Boys, you've got The Bear Season 3, you've got This Now also. Gonna be awesome. But what do I think about this trailer? Honestly, I think it's fair to say that Disney Plus Star Wars shows have not been that great generally. Like, there's standouts like Andor, and then, you know, The Mandalorian, like, Season 1, maybe Season 2. But besides that, they've pretty much been flops. This is one that I don't think a lot of people have really been super excited about, and I can't blame them. But... The premise does seem cool. I mean, I was reading about it. Apparently, there's, like, Jedi that are just being killed. There's some mysterious killer on the loose. And it's almost like a more of a detective type of story. I'm down for that. I saw the guy from Squid Games in here, which is really cool. That he's sort of getting, like, this real breakout beyond, you know, Squid Game into, like, a big franchise like Star Wars. I don't really see any other actors are recognized, which I'm not complaining. I honestly really like that people are getting, like, new shots. Also, Daphne Keene is also in here. forgot to mention her. But I think everything looks pretty cool. It didn't, like, wow me. You know, had some cool moments again, but there wasn't really anything that had me dying to watch this show. I do think it's interesting. I am honestly a little bit more excited because that poster they dropped yesterday did, again, intrigue me. It was interesting enough, but I don't know. Nothing was really in here that just blew me away. It was cool enough, but I feel like Star Wars should be exciting. It should be like, I should watch this trailer and be like, whoa, the Force Awakens trailer comes to mind where, yeah, I get that this is a Disney Plus TV show, but still just kind of that real thrilling presence it brings. I wish that we got more of that. And I mean, listen, at the end of the day, not that they're ever going to do this because money, but I wish they would just stop making Disney Plus TV shows just overall, whether it's Star Wars or Marvel, but it's not going to stop happening because they need to put content on their streaming service. And yeah, again, this could be pretty cool. But my expectations, I just want to keep them kind of in the middle or even low because, man, I've been disappointed before. Obi-Wan, I still think that's honestly a pretty horrible show. Just in my opinion, if you like it, I'm happy you do. I think it's a really bad show. But, yeah, you know, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Also, I have a Furiosa trailer reaction that I'm putting out at the same time. So if you want to go check that one out, feel free to check it out. But, guys, let me know your thoughts on this trailer down below. Did you like it? Did you hate it? Did anything really shock you here or anything really wow you or were you just kind of like, eh, seems interesting enough. But guys, that's going to just about do it for this video today. Thank you guys for watching. I love you and I'll see you in the next video.